up working next to a nigga driving him nigga crazy. <laughs> you gotta smile though. <laughs> Look at him fucking go. <laughs> Look at him fucking go. Come on, man. Hold on, bro. Is he the man? He's the man. <laughs> Yo, 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 what's up, what's up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new, do me a favor and make sure you subscribe. Do not forget to hit that bell too, that way you stay updated. And if you're not new, I ain't even got to tell you, man. I truly, truly appreciate you. Thank you for tuning in and thank you for supporting my channel. Do me a favor and smash that thumbs up button. Give it two thumbs up if you can. Like, share, and comment. Help my channel grow. Help my videos get recommended. That is extremely important for my channel to grow. And I would truly appreciate that, y'all. Truly. So, I am back with another reaction. Actually, a special reaction. This is a special request from one of my faithful Patreons, man, and YouTube subscribers. He told me not to mention his name. But, you know, I got to show my love, man. Especially when you mess with me heavy. Alex P. Yeah, I think, I believe that he recommended this movie after I'd done another Clint Eastwood movie, I believe. As soon as I got done with that reaction, he was like, man, dude, you got to do it. So, yeah, he decided to donate to my channel. You know what I'm saying? And here I am. Here I am, man. So, um, I believe that Alex P has been a subscriber to my channel since I had maybe, what, I don't know, 5,000 subscribers, I believe. And I think he was one of my first Patreons, too, which makes it even more special. So, I just truly, truly appreciate you. Thank you for supporting my channel. You know, you always comment and show me love. So, again, thank you. And thank you for donating. Um, again, this is a Clint Eastwood movie, man. It Not is registered. Outlaw Josie Wales. Um, one thing about Clint Eastwood I gotta say is that <laughs> if no matter how manly you think you are, once you watch Clint Eastwood, you realize you ain't shit. That dude is savage, and his temper, man. Well, I wouldn't say he has a bad temper. But once you piss him off, it's a wrap. It's a wrap, man. He definitely makes you man up. So I am absolutely looking forward to this, man, because this dude is an absolute classic, man. And you know that he has that gun blazing action, which I absolutely love. So, again, I am excited, man. I hope you are. Check this out. I'm going to put the link to my Patreon at the bottom. Check that out. Movie reaction, TV shows, regular reactions, and anime. With that, you can see this full, uncut, unedited reaction of this. All my other movies, all my other TV shows, you get to vote on polls. And the best part, you get to see stuff before I put it on YouTube, meaning you guys are late. And I have a couple of slots open for the month where you guys can donate to my channel. And you know, I'm saying, Tim, what you, want, what you want me to react to? And I got you. No questions asked. Just don't touch me with no bullshit. I'm going to do it. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, but whatever. Anyway, man, hope you guys enjoy my reaction. Let's get to it. Get him, girl. Get him. That's some hard work there, boy. I ain't never been no former. But that shit is not, that shit is not easy. Make a man out of you real quick. Little Josie! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Ah! Here goes the boy. Early. better kill him, bro. They better kill him, dog. You ain't got no choice now. Nah. You done burned my fucking house down and, I assume, wiping his wife and killed his son? Is that his son, man? Lord gives. Lord takes away. <laughs> That'll make, I ain't quite <laughs> dead. That'll almost make you question God, man. So they took his wife. Where's his wife? They took it. No, okay. It's gonna sound real bad. I ain't gonna lie to you. But I prefer they take my wife and murder her brother. See what they're gonna keep her and rape her. And torture her, dog. And that, that sound real bad, man. Bro. Ain't no telling what they're gonna do to her. Bloody Bill's what they call me. Red legs? With the union. We're going up there and set things all right. 
So they're doing this shit all over. They're on the path of destruction, huh? Raise his right hand and swear as such as you'll be loyal, and he can take up his horse again and go home. You gonna give us full limits to them? Yep. Well, uh, Clint, he ain't got no home. I'm going in, boys. I've had enough. Now that they gonna lead us, uh, let's turn it in. Should I guess everybody's gonna follow him, huh? Better go with him, boy. Are you coming with us, Josie? There's nowhere you can go to get away from him. So I ain't trying to get away. Yeah, he walk away from that shit. And they killed my family. Can't turn my back on that one. They gotta kill me. Put the rifle down, too. I'll be needing this for squirrels and such. Put it down. Now get in line before I kick you so hard you'll be wearing your ass for a hat. Now you got a mother telling you what to do. What the hell is this red leg doing here? Regular federal authorities would be handling this. Dentero is. The regular federal authority now. Woo! So the same people that y'all were trying to elbow after. Is there y'all on the same team now? Don't piss down my back and tell me it's raining. <laughs> Easy, Terrell. He brought them all in, didn't he? All but one. Josie Wales. <laughs> remember that name. He must remember. He gotta remember. Take five. He must have a reputation. Up and get Josie Wales. Captain Redlegs, Terrell. And five men against Josie Wales. Eh? <laughs> Bring in this damn insurrectionist rebel. <laughs> Here. Here's the money for bringing down the others. Who's... What, what the fuck is this? What is this? I've had enough of your money, Senator. Did you turn yourself in, dog, on the same people y'all were after on the same team now? So forget what, so forget what they done done. Man, f*** that, bro. I want you men to raise your mm, right mm. hand. I'll raise your right hand so I can take your oath. That it is one nation. What's going on here? What, what is this? What is this, bro? I've been thinking. I think it's them who owes an apology. Verminus, Ryan, Missouri, this is what he said. me those men would be decently treated. They were decently fed, and then they were decently shot. Get the fuck out of here. Who team is he on, bruh? Down. I respect that kid, man. I wish he'd have thought about this sooner. What the fuck? He just watched him get shot down. He just watched him get shot down. Y'all should be scared. They should be scared. He done came in and f***ed your whole shit up. One man. Where are we headed? Indian Nation's a place to hole up and get you healed up. Now, if you see me get up, you stay there, understand? Here's some shooting and me headed back north. Back on that horse, he'll get right up with you. And you head south. Them boys good. Them boys are good. Yeah, I'll be in fair in Kansas, Red Lake, Zura Gorillas. You name it. Depending upon present company. Say as I... <laughs> Blame you for that? No, don't touch me, dog. How much for the ferry ride? Ten cent. Oh, pleasure. You know, Bill Quantrill used this ferry all the time. Good friend of mine. I'll give up on all that. I want to use the ferry, bro. Look away, look away, Dixie Man. That, that sure is a sweet sound to the ears. Wouldn't you say so, Mr. Hell no, shut up. <laughs> this is it. One dollar a bottle. It works wonders on wounds. Works wonders on just about everything, huh? It can do most anything. <laughs> Get that stain out. Show me your work. He spit on that man. Oh, that's him. Whooped him again, Josie. I hey. think you something's wrong. Until you get going. What are we gonna do? Yo, cut that fucking rope. That's a long boy. <laughs> you ain't gonna miss with that one. Do you really think you can shoot all those men down before they shoot you? He pissed. He pissed. I knew it. I knew it. I fucking knew it. I ain't surprised.
They stranded. They are stranded. If and I don't make it, Josie, I want you to know I'm prouder than a game rooster to rid with ye. He the only one got guts out of the, all them all them grown ass men. He was the youngest. He's like, I'm my son. I'm not finna say shit. I'm not finna swear in. It's him, Abe. It's him. Damn. We got the Josie Wales, Abe. Damn, he's sitting there. I seen him ride side to them. side with Bloody Bill, Abe. We got reward money coming. Watch it, Abe. He's meaner than a rattler and twice as fast with them pistols. <gasps> they nervous. They nervous. They should be. The Rose of Alabama. Who is that? Sweet tobacco. Turn your back Just on me, boy. You know, turn your back on me, boy. Tell him to shut up. Pa? Is that ye, Pa? <laughs> There's no gold. He's crazy. The gold me and Josie robbed from the bank, Pa. Take a look under that there blanket. This is set up. I got it right here. He been blast your stupid ass. Blast your stupid ass. Way too long. Wish sure we have time to bury them fellas. What the hell was them fellas? <laughs> He's been on the ah! <laughs> That boy, he don't give a damn. I want to thank you for what? Saving my life. Hell, kid, he a fighter, boy. That boy tough. We can start working our way through now, boy. This rain's giving us the edge. Blue Billies will give you a better burial than I can. They stupid as hell. You think a person would just ride through y'all, just ride through y'all shit like that, huh? He just rides straight through. Name's Josie Wales. I've heard of that name. They call us civilized because we're easy to sneak up on. And now the white man is sneaking up on me. Uh, hey, we ain't got no beef, bro. You lost just as much as I have. Seems like we can't trust the white man. You bet we can. Jim Puckmark and me. I'm Lone Wadi. We thought about it for a long time. And <laughs> That's too rude, man. You come on this man property, dog. It falls about his shit. Why you can't why he tells you a story about his life? <laughs> A horned toad can tell you which way to go. But when I got civilized, I forgot all these things. I didn't know which way to go. I didn't know there were others that hadn't surrendered. I didn't surrender neither. But uh, they took my horse and made him surrender. <laughs> they took his horse and made the horse surrender. Beaver? Beaver ain't no good no more. Hmm. Give me ten musk rat. Oh. Spilling. What the fuck? Fuck? You hear the death, bro? What kind of, kind of businessman is that? This is what you give those Indians. Where's the real stuff? What do you take for the squad? Like you must have stole her or something. She ain't for sale. Tell you, Zuka, you put her on the bill, too. <laughs> he, 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 he could beat on her. He a man with her, but he ain't no man with no man, huh? Oh, bitch. I'll be looking for a horse. Oh, horses belong to these gentlemen. I got him. I recognized him, too. Mr. Chain Blue Lightning is the elf. Twitch your finger. I'll splatter your guts all over the wall. <laughs> they stupid. By the time you pull that hammer down, he ain't got you. Ain't <laughs> like that easy, huh? Nope. Nope. Oh, shit. Oh, hey. I'm getting better at sneaking up on you like this. <laughs> Only an Indian can do something like this. That's what I figured. You figured. Mm-mm. Your own people, huh? Blow his shit off. Oh, sneaky ass. We did aid the men, Shle. The hunt is a go. Not finna shit and does the hell do the shenaz e. A coca. She said does the e. Can't you get her to shut up? Look what patience is thin. He ain't got patience for nobody. <laughs> for nobody. Hi, I still talk to him. You know, she thinks I'm some kind of a Cherokee chief. It means you red bone hound got no place else to go either. Get out of He's 
on a fucking dog. He be on a fucking dog. <laughs> Spit on me, bro. Dog, this motherfucker is fucking spit on my head. <laughs> yeah. The weed is from Kansas, and the molasses comes from Missouri. Well, sir, we'll do without molasses. Anything from Missouri has a taint about it. Now, Grandma, you've got to tread lightly now we're here in Texas. And treading lightly is not my way. What them old folks, but they don't care what they say. I'm a Hoosier myself. Personally, I don't think much of Hoosiers neither. <laughs> Oh, fuck, what the hell can what they say? <laughs> they don't care. We'll talk. Josie Wales. What say? Josie mm. Wales. They say he's coming into Texas. Won't come through here, though. <laughs> We're about to blow your shit out. Oh, my God. It's Josie Wales. Why, well, you're going to pull those pistols and whistle Dixie. <laughs> Indians on this team. I guess we ain't going to see that little Navajo girl again. Well, I guess not. I can identify him, and <laughs> I'd certainly be glad to share in any reward. <laughs> Knew him quite well, actually. No, he really did. He looked dead in his damn face and he recognized. Look at those boys over there. Tied down guns. Baby. Bounty hunters. I don't want to hear Wales dead. I want to see Wales dead. Uh. Guess he said they can't kill him. They ain't got a shot in hell. All of them men. <laughs> Old Mac ain't handling. Old Mac ain't handling. She about to stab me. You stopped me when you did. I might have killed her. <laughs> she almost she would stab your ass up. She a fighter. She is a fighter, bro. Sure pays to have an edge. Yeah. All kind of edges. <laughs> I'm old, but I ain't blind. Well, I get the fuck out of here. Howdy. Get out of here. Is there something wrong? Nope. Get him some skins, huh? Get him some skins. Maybe nine horses and a couple of carts. <laughs> oh, shit. What's back there? Ah! Ten birds are gonna want himself a fresh woman. One of you has to take that old woman over there. That boy says you gotta get some. If you, if you can't, if you gotta rape somebody. He's no man here. What the? This old man, no, he comes. <laughs> he lost. Was he drunk or something? I guess he lost, he lost his, his Indian cheat just that damn quick. You just gonna sit there all day? You gonna run out and see what he wants? Pretty little lady. <laughs> Alice coming to breakfast. Got one man, dog. One man by himself. When I pull him before. <laughs> That's the sign. The disrespectful sign. Of <laughs> it's a hell coming. Hell is coming. I'm halfway to Mexico Bye, by now, except for that crazy squaw. I can't understand a word she says. I knew that would bring me. Uh, help us. Uh, yeah, boy, he Helping people. Keep his ass in trouble. That boy, a stone cold killer. He got a heart. What do we have? Whiskey. <laughs> Whiskey, he says. Beer then. Been a long time since anybody bought a drink around here. Why would you ask what I want, though? I'm, I'm confused. Why would you ask? 
you can't you can't accommodate. Might you be the mother of Tom Turner, whose Crooked River Ranch is over by Blood Butte? I am Rose, Rose of Santa Rio. I reckon he wrote y'all about me. Recollect that. <laughs> I'm looking for Josie Wales. You a bounty hunter? Yeah, he's got to do something for a living these days. Diane ain't much of a living boy. Hey, <laughs> just blast it. You just blast it. This is one what you don't want. I had to come back. I know. Stupid ass. Now your ass dead. Comanche? Comanche's all right. You stay with the car. Let me go talk to him. Shit. <laughs> Boy, fearless. He is fearless. You men, chop some wood. Do come all this way to gawk. You don't eat around here. Figure you for a loafer. Oh! <laughs> Granny! <laughs> Granny! <laughs> Granny ain't put up with that shit. <laughs> Make the point. Hold that spit. It's the first time she ever had a place of her own. I'm glad there's going to be a man around to take care of things. Why don't you stay with us? Maybe they'll forget you. You know, there ain't no forgetting. Hey, I feel them on that. So you stay there, you're going to be put everybody in danger. So it's best that I leave, go take care of business, and then come back from time to time. And thanks a lot for Josie Wales, who you changed from a murdering bushwhacker. On the side of Satan. We're getting us together in Texas. Speak too soon, ma'am. Speak too soon, ma'am. Ken Barry, he got Travis and Chatter. He'd be riding in here in the morning. I was looking for a place to hold up. I'd pick this one. All made out of mud, nothing to burn. Two doors, front and back. Huh. That's smart. The only blind spot is the ceiling. Dig a hole in it and drop down, maybe in the back bedroom. Anybody gets hit, sing out, I'll slap iron to it. That's the fastest way to stop the blood. What's all that paint about? It's going to warm. It's my death face. Where you going? He knows he can do the best for us on the back of a horse. He's going down into the valley to kill ten bears. He a bad man. Josie Bad, but damn, I don't know. That's a lot of mouthful people, bro. A whole tribe against one. And be honest, if they get past him, dog, then shit, man. The uh, the grand, they ain't gonna stand much of a chance. Be ten bears? I am ten bears. I'm Josie Wales. I have heard. You may go in peace. I reckon not. Nah, dog. You got my men. Got nowhere to go. And you will die. I came here to die with you. I can get you before I can get you before they kill me. I came here like this so you'll know my word of death is true, and that my word of life is then true. I will only hunt what we need to live on, same as the Comanche does. The sign of the Comanche, that will be on our lodge. That's my word of life. And your word of death? It's here in my pistols, <laughs> there in your rifles. I'm here for either one. <laughs> either way, either way. The words of ten bears carries the same iron of life and death. It is good that warriors such as we meet in the struggle of life or death. So we get next. It shall be life. Josie is a bad man, boy. Josie's a bad man. Bad man. He is not scared, boy. Hey, motherfucker, look, we can either live or we can die. Either way, I'm cool either way. I'm gonna let you choose. I'm gonna blast your ass. I never thought I'd see you again. Right through this window when he shot my partner. Some old lady and a scrawny girl. She's about to face him down alone. One man. It's been nice riding with you, Chief. Same here. You're all alone now, Wells. Not quite alone. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that shit. I wasn't expecting that. I wasn't expecting that. They blasting their ass. Hell of a fight. Where they fucking go? Where they go? To the back, like he said. That's the weak spot. One got in. Ready? 
Get another one. Get another gun. Watch your back. Watch that thing. <laughs> I got that kickback. Hope he rides the timber. They will pull a boy scab off. Kill on his own fucking knife. Let me try to pull that big ass sword out, bro. Is that what you expect to happen? Hello, Mr. Wilson. Uh, two fellas down here is Texas Rangers. Uh, what did you say your name was, friend? My name's Fletcher. Fletcher. That's right, Mr. Fletcher. There we go. He went up against five pistol arrows. He got three of them before they cut him down. Well, if that's what happened, then uh, Josie Wales must be dead. I don't believe that story about Josie Wales. I don't believe no five pistoleros could do in Josie Wales. I think he's still alive. I think I'll go down to Mexico to try to find him. You gonna leave him be? Leave him be, huh? And then? I think I'll try to tell him the war is over. What do you say, Mr. Wilson? I reckon so. I'll tell him, I said, do something right. Do right by somebody. Yo, yo, yo. Another badass Clint Eastwood movie, man. Damn good movie, dog. Um, you know what's funny is that um it seemed as if Fletcher and I guess and the older Indian guy was the only people who recognized how bad Josie was. They knew that no matter how many guns you had, you couldn't be Josie Wells. <laughs> he couldn't be he didn't give a fuck about dying. And Fletcher knew best because I remember early on in the movie. When uh, I think the general, whoever it was, was going to send, I think maybe a handful of men to go get Josie. And he was like, that's all you're going to send? He was like, dog, they ain't enough. And you know something? They could not have lost as much as Josie because they surrendered to me too easily. If the same people you're going to surrender to went in and, well, I guess it wasn't them per se. But anyway, the people you were after who killed your family, burned your house, and killed your children for civil lives, man, I'm not going to, I'm not going to turn over, bro. Not until I get vengeance. It's, uh, it's dope, man. Like, it just shows you how crazy and how big of a badass Josie was for everybody to turn themselves in. Your whole squad, and you chose to fight alone, after they turned themselves in, it seems as if the only person who had guts was the young dude. He was the only one, because you could tell that they wasn't for sure about surrendering, but they didn't want to say shit. That young man, he was the only one who had guts. And lo and behold, it was a fucking trap. It's messed up that Fletcher done that shit. So I wonder early on, like, what else he do because I remember him telling the general that he was done taking his money. So he must have done some, some other backdoor shit previous to that. I hate that the young dude died, though, man. I hate that he died, man, but I definitely respect the fact that he went out with a bang because before he died, he saved Josie's life. What was up with Josie in the spitting? <laughs> this dude... He would spit on anything. He even spit on a damn dog. He was funny as hell because he was such a badass that he did not care. He went into, was it Timber's? He went to Timber's camp. Where he was surrounded by en enemies by himself. And basically told them that, hey, look, look, we can either live or we can die. I'm here for either one. We can live in peace or we can die fighting each other. And I can tell you right now, before I die, I'm going to kill you. And I could tell that Tim Bear respected that shit, man, because Josie was by himself. And what I understood was that he was saying is that because they had weapons, they both had control over giving life and taking life. And I'm glad that uh, I was expecting Tim Bears to come back and help them when they were surrounded. But they didn't need their help. I'm impressed how the, the old lady and the few held up against that whole fucking squad. Of course, they had Josie, but I'm impressed. I am highly impressed, man. I'm glad that Fletcher decided to let Josie go because he, he at least owed them that much. You went to battle with these same men that you portrayed it and at least do this one thing right. So, anyway, man, I truly enjoyed this movie, man. Clint Eastwood did not disappoint. Did not disappoint, man. That dude, he, he's a fucking savage. I noticed that in every movie, 
He's always cool, calm, and collected, man. He minds his own business. But there is always something or someone who has to fuck with him and poke the bird. Poke the bird. At that moment, he goes on a fucking rampage. So, anyway, man, I hope you guys enjoy my reaction. Give your boy a thumbs up, like, share, and comment. Again, I want to thank my Patreon and faithful supporter, LSP, for recommending this. Thank you for your donation. I hope you enjoy my reaction, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.